out the handles. You want this to be more than shoulder width, your hands. You don't want to be tight. So I'm going to go from hip to overhead. Hip to overhead. Now the idea is that I'm not going to hip and bend or hip and pull. So I want both my knees to feel like they have the exact same amount of weight pushing through the pad the entire time. If that feels weird on the shoulder, ask the instructor about modifications you can do with your hand and your width or different attachments. Ideally, the wider the hand, right? We can make a Y, but it's hard to make an I. So we wanna think about that when we're doing that transition. If I can get into my nice, happy Y, then my shoulder is gonna be happier in that position. If I cannot reach overhead, right, I'm just gonna go as high as I can and then come back down. As the weight's trying to break me and all of those range of motions. Do I look crazy? You look crazy, yeah. Right? And the last thing we're gonna do, we have a lot of pulling motions, right? We have a lot of curls, a lot of rows, all of our back motions are pulling. We want to make sure that our elbows stay nice and healthy.